All right, where is reward, bro? One of these guys, right? Не тот уже хабар пошел, не тот. Не уж что завязывать пора. Is it one of these dudes? I hope he didn't die. Oh, reward is the duty barkeep. Oh, okay. Great. Thank you. Oh, hey, uh, Propuco, if you don't mind keeping it in English in the chat. I actually read and try to interact with you guys as much as I can. So it's a little tough if people talk in languages I don't know. I have a hard enough time understanding English, let's be real. Jezre, thank you, bud. Sometimes I know English good. <laughs> Dude, I am super sad, but I think we're going to have to start thinking about replacing this armor. Yeah. What's the name of the kitty behind me? This is Dimitri. Get out of here, stalker. Get out of here, stalker. Somebody earlier said, are we going to be playing stalker 2? I am not only going to play stalker 2. We are doing what we call on this channel a 100 co cent run, which means that every single square inch of stalker 2 will be thoroughly explored from the inside out. Every quest we can do, every area we can do, like every everywhere we can go and everything we can do in that game we're going to do. I am, it is one of my most anticipated games. So, Which is why we're doing the franchise playthrough before it. You brought the documents from X-18? I did, here. Good, the situation is becoming clearer. As I expected, this brain scorcher is man-made. It's a Kamenov experimental emitter, and its components were made exactly in X-18. These documents refer to Lab X-16, where they sent some components. According to this, X-16 is located in the production complex area by Lake Yenta. The scientists have set up a mobile lab around here, so maybe they can help. Go on. It ain't simple. You need to get to the scientists and find out where X-16 is so you can get the missing documents. So, you up for it? I am very up for it. I'm here for the job. Got Gravi and Fireball. We killed a uh, vampire and we did camp defense. We still have to defeat the destroy the group vans at Agrapom. And obtain the flesh eye. Huh. Okay. My information might not be of use to you, Stalker. Oh, here. What's up, man? Interesting. Okay. No jobs. Monolith stuff. You already did your job. Uh, let's take a look here. So we're going to put this away for now. Free up some space. We're also going to put a lot of these away. Put a bunch of these Summer away. Rains. There we go. There we go. OK. 
Okay, so we can sell you, 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 and you. You and you. It's so annoying that it doesn't show you what you've got equipped. I think we're fine for now. We can tell you and you. Come How is it going? I've always got something interesting for people like you. I think we want to save the mama's beads, don't we? Yeah, that's the only one of those we have. We can sell this guy and... Oh, that's our only one of that. Okay. Okay. I think we're good. There we go. All right, we're trimmed down. 35 weight, not bad. We've only got one gun, but we'll make it work. Man, I guess that's fate. I need a job. Kill the stalker. And find the artifact Flash. Do I have a Flash artifact? It's pretty great. Um, is my barrel armor suit better now? It might be. Let's take a look. Mm. No, this is still better, I think. Bulletproofing's better, but everything else is a lot lower. Yeah, we'll go ahead and wear this one out. You can't help but to take up booze with this life. Just want to forget everything. Okay. I think we're set. Is there anything else we want? I think we're good. save it. Is this stream AI? Yes. I'm actually just a big AI. Oh, we can put some of the ammo away. But we don't, since it's our only gun now, we want to bring, probably, let's bring 200 with us. Yeah. All right, next up for us is, I think, Yantar, right? And the only way to get there is through this other area. Yep, let's do it. Man, this is the most free weight we've had the entire game, I think. <laughs> this is great. Now we can just sprint forever. I like it, Baines. Hey, chat, you have a gorgeous butt. Oh. Well. I disagree with that. Mm. That does have a pretty nice derriere. Oh, shit. Wait, what is this? Who are all of you? Stalkers? Oh, dude, if I had come here in the main story, would these guys have helped me kill the snipers?
Oh damn. Oh no. Okay. Go get them, bro. I like that shuffle, man. It's okay, I'll loot your buddy for you. I got him. Ow. Ooh, we'll take that. I looted that man's sausage. Wow, we just got like four places in the last, uh, or three places in the last area. Oh shit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Right in his stork butt. We're going for it. And this level completely changed since we've come through it in terms of like what's here and it's wild. Yeah, for those who weren't here earlier in this run, we, we already fought all the way through here. A helicopter crashed. We saved the pilot and brought him to Yantar. So we've already done a bunch of stuff here. This is all just natural stuff that respawned. It's one of the reasons I actually love the Stalker franchise. It, it does such a good job at making the, the zone feel alive. Every enemy we just saw in there was new since we'd been in that zone. Mad Dog says, can't wait for Stalker 2. I know, dude. I know. My only hope for Stalker 2 is that they remember everything that made Stalker special and they just improve on it. I'm really, really, really hoping they don't, like, shrink the scope of this game. Which, you know, would be the easy thing to do. Make it more linear. Make, make it less immersive in terms of the mechanics it offer in the overworld and such. So, we'll see, of course, but... I, I still have very high hopes. Oh, whoa. Nice. That's a good one. Like, yeah, yeah, I'm hoping it doesn't become more like a Metro. Which, don't get me wrong, Metro's amazing, and, it, and I'm, I'd still be there for it, but, you know, one of the things that makes Stalker so special is that it's Stalker. <laughs> Yeah, Metro is much more linear. Even even the, the open world Metro, which is Exodus, is is still semi-open world, where I would say this is much more open world. Uh, I'm looking for Lab X16. The barkeep told me you might have info about its location. I've had a long interest in Lab X18, or rather in the mechanism inside that generates emissions which directly affect people's consciousness. I'm afraid I have to disappoint you. The place is impossible to penetrate without special Psy armor. The outcome is known in advance. Even if you can evade the swarms of zombies that infest the laboratory entrance, you run the risk of becoming one of them. This is all very serious. However, we designed a screening device to help you shield the emission. And to fine tune it, we have to obtain additional measurements. If you help us with this task, we could probably provide you with a fully calibrated prototype for field testing. I will help you get these measurements. Talk to Kruglov. Okay. Hello? 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 
Um, do you have anything we want? Not really. Okay. Hello. That. The professor asked me to make a trip to the measurement sites. Oh, you're coming too? Ooh. It's still dangerous outside. You go first. Check the area outside the lab. The monsters have been very active lately. What have we here? Already cleared out a bunch of guys out here. Oh, there's some out here, too. They don't leave gray dots on the map? Really? Uh-oh. Did he bug out? Drowning dog, thank you, bud. Oh. What's well, a flash? Okay, okay. A little off the scale, but the radiation is normal. We need to move on. I gotta say, I'm looking forward to Clear Sky and Call It Pripyat for the emissions. That was always such a cool mechanic. Tell them, buddy. Blind Rar with a 10 bomb. Thank you, but oh, Jesus. I got a hard enough time aiming normally, man. Blind Rar, thank you for the support. Shit. Imminent blowout. Run, Mark. Run. Thank you. We can't just leave him like that. Just leave him. There is nothing we can do for him. Go out his minutes away and won't get through with him. No, thank I'm not leaving him. Sure. 
I, ouch, are you live? Come on, get up, get up slowly. It's all over, it's behind us. So did somebody drag us in there? Never understood that scene. Looks like somebody helped us. That was a quick recovery. He's got a lot of constitution. Yeah. Very high con value. And he's got medkit. The graphics were good for their time. The graphics are still pretty good. <laughs> I mean, you know, it's not AAA, but... Hell, I'd play a game these days that had these graphics for sure. It'd be just fine. Let me go ahead and see if I can clear some of this out. I'm gonna play Like a Dragon Ishin on release. Uh, if not on release, soon after. Why is he walking so slow? I have no idea. Uh, Crynatic, no, I haven't. I know about it. I gotta use the bathroom, so I'm gonna do that while this guy moses his way over. Let me adjust the prototype. Did you make it back? Ah! You did an excellent job. 
If the measurements are correct, the prototype should provide you with maximum protection from emission. Glad to hear it. Stalker, now you will be able to break through to laboratory, but unless you turn off the emitter, you won't last long even with the site protection on. We estimated an approximate location of the emitter. It is located in an underground facility. I have marked the spot on your map. Is this a scav run? Yes, this entire this entire game is one big scav run. Pretty much. Yep. How exactly does one get inside the lab? Vasiliev was working on the lab issue. About a week ago, he and a stalker called Ghost tried to get inside. A couple of hours later, we felt a major tremor, and after another hour, we picked up a signal from Vasiliev, coming from the swamp, but it died away. And Vasiliev died away with it, it would seem. Tried to find his corpse. He had the exact information on the lab and the way to get into it. There may even be info on deactivating that source of the emission. I've uploaded you all the data we have. You think Vasiliev has them? Perhaps, at any rate, you must start by finding his body. That is the only chance of obtaining accurate information about the lab's location. The body of your colleague, Ghost, must be somewhere there as well. You know, it seemed to me like he knew a lot more about X-16 than he admitted to us. Had he somehow survived, well, it's no use holding on to that hope, of course. Let's try. Hello? Hello? Hello. Oh, damn it. This is the guy that needed the snork part. We just banked that in the other area. <laughs> Okay. Whoops. I am super good at video games. The best. Okay. All right, we're going right over this way. Hey, just fan. Good morning, bud. How you doing? Oh, speaking of snorks. Can you headshot snorks or do they count as monsters and don't really care about headshots? Okay, that answers that question. Dying Arrows with the 80 months, the big 8-0. Thanks for the streams and vibes. Well, thank you for supporting them, my dude. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. God, I love this gun. I hate that they don't leave corpse marks on my freaking radar, though. There we go. Okay, there's that. Great. I hear one in front of me. There you are. Gotcha. There's two in there. Go on the outside. Why are we playing Hogwarts Legacy? Uh, not on release, no. Too many other games I want to play. Hey, check it out later, though. People say it's good. Not really a big Hogwarts guy. Or Harry Potter guy, I should say. 
Oh, that music. That's a good ammo. It was a Hogwarts release date? Oh, God, what, a week, I think, something like that? Are we playing the RE4 remake? Oh God, yes. We've got all the papers. We know how to deactivate the source of the emission. Proceeding to dig into the lab with Ghost. <laughs> Zombies coming out of everywhere. He's all screwed up. Ghost has gone insane. He must have been affected by the emissions. I I've dropped everything, trying to get out through the tunnels. I I'm at the swamp, but where's the bunker? Shit, shit, shit. I, I can't make out my whereabouts. No response from Sakharov. What's going on? Zombies everywhere. I'm running out of ammo. And that's the last we heard of him. Thank you, Danny. Appreciate it, bud. Oh, it is the seventh. Seventh if you got the deluxe. Cool. Okay. Yeah, I'll be doing lots of stuff before then. We've got Stalker to play through and uh, Deliver Us Mars starts in like half an hour. We're going to see how that game is. Maybe more Hi-Fi Rush. And then I think there's another game that comes. Dark and Darker. That's right. We're going to be doing Dark and Darker too, which I'm very excited about as well. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we got a we got a lot going on. Uh let's go ahead and bring this back. No No thanks. Solo queue, new dungeon, and VIP coming next D and D test? Really? 